And what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Dro, man. I am back with another video. Apparently, Apple made a face mask. Um, yeah, Apple, yeah, Apple the brand made a face mask. I'm talking about if this face mask cannot call my mom, cannot call my dad, cannot call my sister, cannot call my auntie, cannot call my uncle. I don't want it, bro. Cause like I know for a fact it's gonna be expensive as hell. Like Apple stuff is always expensive. I don't know, like no reason. You feel me? Like, like I say, man. Like I say, if this face mask cannot call my mom, I say, hey Siri, call mom. It's, it's not saying it's not gonna do that. I don't want it, man. I don't want it. It's, if it's gonna be like just like a regular face mask, that I can just throw away, man. I don't want it. If 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 I cannot call my mom on the face mask. I don't want it, man. If I cannot call my mom, pops, I don't want it. But like I said, man, it's shocking to me too. I, I didn't know they, I didn't know Apple made a face mask. You know, hopefully, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's dope. You know, I know what to expect. Um, somebody told me I should react to it. Um, so I'm going to react to it. Like I said, if I if I cannot call my mom, I'm not buying that, bro. Especially it'd be expensive. Face mask for like. Two hundred dollars for what, bro? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. So that's for the guy. Look, guys. That's what I do, guys. Um, if you guys are new, subscribe. If you guys are not new, you know the vibe, man. Drop a like down below. for what I do. Let's get going. Um, uh, yeah. Let's get started. I'm trying to see this face mask. If it's dope or not. Let's press play. Okay. Nice little package. Check me out. The Apple engineers went to the drawing board to build a better mask. Apple actually nice designed package, you feel me? their very own mask for their employees in store to wear. They've actually got a couple different versions, but this is kind of the standard. This is what most employees will be wearing. It's what most employees of Apple will have. We've got some iPhone 12 later case news coming at the end of this video, so stick around for that. Willie Do pulled it off, plus some viewers of the Lou Later Show downstairs that got in touch with him, so shout out to them anonymously. This in front of me is the official Apple mask. This is the reusable face mask in medium That's the mask large. Right there. For more information, please visit welcomeforward.apple.com. What was crazy to me is on the packaging, which is all very Apple esque, as you can tell, we have what looks like a serial number, definitely an item number, and hmm. a lot number and production That's dope. date. That's so, dope. just like everything else, Apple tremendously detailed stuff over here and an unboxing experience that looks like it's kind of beyond what you would expect for a reusable face mask. So even on the back, designed by Apple in California, assembled in China. You gotta get that in there on every single Apple product. Let's get this has going, to be one let's of get to the, the mask, most unusual man. Apple unboxing videos I've ever done. So we pop into it and first thing we see is, in, is a little attachment, a little adapter, actually, to hold the mask on at the back of the head. You don't see this on your typical cheap mask. I actually have some of those here as well for comparison. This little piece, how do I even, how does that come out of there? So there's two of these little guys, and this is gonna go on the back side of the mask to hold it on more securely than, I suppose, just using your ears, or do you even use your ears at all? This is the packaging for the mask. Now, each one of these boxes, which an employee would receive, would actually include what looks like five of these masks, and they are not one-time use. In fact, there's some, some rules around how frequently these hmm. would be used hmm. for an Apple employee. Uh, each mask is uh, capable of being worn five times for up to eight hours each time. So it's supposed to be washed once every eight hours. If you're a part-time Apple employee, you wouldn't have to wash it every single shift. If you were a full-time Apple employee, you would wash it after every single shift. Five times would be the maximum for usage. So it is disposable. It's reusable and disposable. It's reusable to a point. And I guess that just keeps, it just makes hmm. sure that the, that the quality is still there, okay. that the uh, functionality is still there without breaking down if you go ahead and wash it more than that. Where do I, there's a little line here. I see, look. Of course, what? Apple what? packaging here. Apple claims, and I read this on the original report, that this they believe this is a superior mask for daily wear compared to the cheapo. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna pause it right here. Pause right here, man. So that's what it'll do. 
the package is nice, you know. The package is nice. Everything's simply nice. Everything is awesome, you no know? legit. You know what I'm saying? Everything look crispy. You feel me? But um, don't tell me this. Don't have cereal on there, man. Like what? I'm not buying this mask. Like I could buy. I'll go to a store right now and buy a mask for like what? Three bucks. I guarantee you this is not three bucks. It's not three bucks at all. I mean, I don't know. And you can make your own mask at home. Like, just get a little, you know, do what you gotta do. But like, I don't know. Let's keep watching the video. Maybe there is something in, in the mask. I don't know. Let's, I don't know. Let's see. Definitely, I mean, it looks cool. That's for sure. So it has what looks to be an option here. I believe I could just hook this around my ears or, and then I could hook this piece at the back side. Let's see. This part folds up. This part folds down. Oh, wow. All right, let me try this out here. And this is gonna go around the ears. And I guess there's a pinch point here. Ooh, okay. So, as you can tell, I mean, that's a different fit than what you get out of a typical surgical mask. It, it, it's much more structured, in fact. So I'm gonna pull one of these out for comparison real quick. So you can see this is just a, Literally. a relatively flimsy sheet. Whereas this one has, well, it has three pieces to it. There's the center piece here. Hey, I ain't gonna lie though, it does, it does fit well, it does fit well. Of course, the beard is not ideal, but it reaches under the chin. And then a separate piece, which comes up and extends over the nose. And then you have this pinch point at the top here. It feels, uh, it feels very secure. As far as breathing is concerned, I'd say it's fairly comparable to this, but I definitely feel more sealed off than a standard surgical mask. Now, of course, you can also take this piece here and hook it onto the back side. Okay, of this okay, loop. okay, 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 okay. The strap is actually uh, quite elastic. This, this, these ear pieces, unlike these, which are, uh, well, they're elastic too, Hold but on. sometimes you're a little concerned about the connection that is point true. that it could rip off. That is true. These things be ripping off all the time. Like I be I be going to a store like I be at work, bro. Like I do one move, pow! I'm like, what, bro? Like it, these things are weak as hell, bro. These things are not really like strong. You know what I'm saying? Like I be putting it on like this, boom, the whole screen comes up. That's why I have my. Uh, I don't wear these. I wear what's it called? It's like a I bought it at the gas station. I don't know. It's like. It's like really like nice and stuff. Like it actually holds, t you know, tight, and you can like uh adjust it. But yeah, these things do uh break off easily though. But the uh, Apple Max though, it's kind of it's kind of nice. It's kind of nice, man. I gotta lie, it it looks it looks good. You know what I'm saying? It looks good. It fits perfectly. You know what I'm saying? It I feel like it's much like you know like fit. They want a mask? I don't know. Uh, they still there's no cereal in them. Uh, I've yanked out a few of these and then this popped up. This feels like it can deal with more tension if you really want to pull it tight. And that's sort of what I have there now. That's like, it's like wearing a hat or something. It feels, it's not going anywhere. It's on there. It certainly gives you a far more secure fit on the mask. So this is what every Apple employee is going to be wearing. It's what they're going to have. So yeah, I mean, it does seem like an improved mask. Uh, it's kind of cool to see a design team look at a product that's not typical for them. Uh, obviously, Apple is more likely to be looking bad, at uh, phone designs and other gadgets and electronics that you may perceive as being more complex, but it is interesting to see Apple's take on the typical disposable, although semi-reusable mask when you compare it to the standard, which we see absolutely everywhere. Now, if I go ahead and just put this unit on, so that's fine too. Now I'm I mean, getting way more air into this one compared to the Apple. And even if you listen to me talking, it's far less muffled. I think this thing is much more serious. And look, it even sort of maintains its structure once you've taken it off. Uh, I can actually breathe a little bit easier in this one, but it's likely because it's not making a tight seal here. Part of that is my beard, but it's also the fit of the mask. 
is just nowhere near as tight as the official Apple mask. So have they improved it? Uh, I would say so. I say that this thing is an improvement over this. However, if you were to purchase this, if Apple was to sell this, you would have to assume it would be far more expensive than this. 20 bucks for like 50 of these, Apple would have to sell that one for more, presumably, if they did sell it. It's a filter, oh, they it's don't definitely sell it, huh? a filter, and it's thicker. And you know, people out there, they, they've posted tests of attempting to blow through different mask material to like blow out a lighter or a candle or something. This one, I mean, and it's just based on my initial exposure here, but this one, not, nothing. There is no, there's zero air getting through that. So they don't really share exactly what the capability of this filter is, like in 3M terms, N95 or something like that. But based on my impression here, this is a, this is a pretty substantial filter. All right, so the last piece we want to take a look at over here is the clear mask, which is the other option for Apple employees. And of course, theirs wouldn't ship like this. This is from the company directly supplying Apple. It's a totally different thing altogether. Uh, apparently it's anti-fog, fluid resistant, improved comfort and breathability. Now this is a much different approach than the style that comes from over the head and wraps around, which leaves a lot of gap uh, under your chin. This one aims to actually seal a little bit under the chin there. Is this what we're doing? Have I got this correct right now? These things are wild. That is that's futuristic looking. <laughs> Try to tighten this up to improve this oh, seal man. around the bottom. And that, that actually does a pretty good job of that. I'm probably more partial to this style of mask. Yeah, me too. Uh, that is can, a... You can feel the moisture inside of here, but these things are important, uh, uh, at least in the sense of... I'm gonna pause the room for this though. Like the clear one, I feel like if you try to talk to somebody and like you mad at them, like they will know like your face expression. So I'll probably go with the other one, you know what I'm saying? I don't like the clear one, cause like, let's say somebody said, hey, um, not you Siri, I'm not talking to you. I'm not talking to you, quite my bad. Anyway, so, so let's say like you, you, you said something to that person, right? And they're like, you're not happy and stuff. Like, they will see your first expression. Well, with the other one, they can't really see your first expression. So, like, it's up to you. Anyway. Like, my voice is muffled quite a bit in this. But the voice being muffled is not a big deal. Or, I should say, it's a trade-off. Because the importance of these masks is for communication and interaction with people who rely on lip reading. This isn't going to help you. If every employee in the store is wearing this one, there's no lips available for communication for those that require it. And this is going to allow for that. So presumably there will be some mix of these styles of masks inside of the Apple store. I don't know if it's an option for each employee to choose or if some are designated to wear this style and others this style, but these apparently are the two masks that are gonna be popping up that you're going to see in the Apple store. They will be the official Apple masks. So what can I say? Is it an improved design? Yeah, I think so. I don't know how feasible it is at scale if some other company wanted to go out and attempt to bring this a similar design to this to the market to sell to people in giant boxes. I don't know how feasible that is, but this is, uh, for me, this is an improvement. Oh, I don't have glasses here, but Will just told me the other advantage here is that it will not fog up glasses if you're wearing glasses because of the tight seal here in the, the construction. I have sunglasses, okay, fine. I guess that would work. Check me out. I can still fog these up. Yeah, no problem. Maybe I gotta go tighter, let's see. <laughs> Hold oh up, I can go God, tighter. Fixed. Just, yep, okay. if you do the nose what? seal nice and tight, what? you can stop you can stop some of the fog from coming up. So anyway, there it is. It's the official That's good. That's good. That's Apple mask. Good. Never thought I'd see the day, but it, it just seems to be the way it is in 2020. And uh, and as I mentioned, the most interesting I guess part that's for the me video is the I think you No, know, it's good. It's a good, it's smart, it's smart from Apple, you know what I'm saying? I get it's not for, it's not to sell, uh, not everybody can get it. I think it's only a Apple employee. So, um, I think it's good at the same time, like, 
it shouldn't be that expensive, man. It's just a mask, you know what I'm saying? It shouldn't be that expensive. It shouldn't be fifty dollars. It shouldn't be, you know, like a hundred dollars. You know what I'm saying? At, at least maybe oh, man, I don't know. I'll probably I'll probably say eight dollars. I don't know. What you guys think? Anyway, I don't know, man. I feel like it's good. It, it's it's well fitted, you know what I'm saying? Like it's it's really good, you know what I'm saying? Like it you know, it blocks uh fogs, you know, if if you wear glasses and stuff like that. But me personally, I'm saying I, I don't really care because you know I if the mask does not have Siri on it, I don't want it, man. I don't even want it. Uh yeah. Let me guys oh uh, so let me oh yeah. Let me know what you guys think about the Apple mask. I guess it's only for Apple employees only, uh that's what they do. It's your boy Dro. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I mean I think it was a good video. You know what I'm saying I didn't expect Apple to make a face mask, you know. But I think it was dope. I think it was dope. I think it was actually nice. You know, yeah. As you know, it's your boy Drill, man. Make sure you guys, you know, leave a like and comment down below what you guys think about this video. If you if you're new, subscribe. If you're not new, you're the vibe. Drop a like down below. So this is your boy and I'll see you next time. Back home, I'm no crazy. I'm on Palmer. I couldn't do the drama. I turned down Madonna. Do you need pajamas? Yeah. Staying the night, girl, you promised it. I hide in the cave like Osama did. I'm going to bag in the diamond district. Do me, me like dollars that are owed to you.